Well, I just got home from work, and I don't know what's going on, but another one of our chickens died. One of the barred rock ones. Last time it was the two red pullets died. And now I come home today to find one of the barred rocked ones. And they, you know, they were fine. Like, you saw the videos. If you've been watching my videos here, you saw it. They were living just fine, no problems. They're all very active, doing their thing. This morning I checked them all. They were all good. I've been checking their vents, making sure everything's good with that. Everything seemed fine, and I pretty much ruled out any kind of issues. But now I come home to find one of the one of the darker ones dead, and I just can't explain what's going on. I'm really starting to question tractor supply and their quality of chickens. I mean, I don't know if it's related to that, but I've been doing everything I can to take care of these things. I've been making sure their temperature's good. They've had plenty of water, plenty of food. I've been, you know, just doing everything I can to, to, to manage them and make sure they, they have a good life. And then I come home, like Friday I came home and found the one dead. And then I come home today, which is today's Tuesday, and another one's dead. So I don't know. Um, the one thing I did notice, I didn't think it would be tasteful to show on here, but it seemed to have like mucus coming out of its beak, not its mouth, but like its little nose holes like up on its on the top of its beak there. It seemed to be mucus in there. So I don't know if maybe they have like a respiratory illness or something. Obviously, I don't have any medication. Um, I don't know if it's worth taking a week old chick to the vet. I'm sure it would probably cost way more than, than uh, what they cost. I mean, I'd obviously want to save them if I could, but... Um, I just don't know. They, the rest of them seem to be fine, but I can't even go by that anymore. It's like I come home and there's dead chickens, and I, I leave for work, they're all great, and I come home and something's wrong. So I don't know if anybody has any information on what it could possibly be, if, if they know anything about mucus. I've, I did a little bit of searching online. Like I said, respiratory illness was like the number one thing that came up. They said you really can't tell just by looking at them, but they're all doing fine. I'll show you what they look like in here. They're all laying down for now. I mean, hopefully they're okay, but we, we had the we had the cage open, and uh, they kind of hide in the corner there when we open it up because they don't want to get picked up because we check them all the time. But they seem to be doing okay. They're just kind of laying there now. I hope there's not a widespread thing going on here with some type of disease or something, but I'm kind of worried. Look how they're... Usually, boy, I'm kind of wondering because usually they don't even lay back there like that. Let me see if I... Stir them up a little bit, see if they get up and move. Yeah, there they go. Are you guys alright? You okay? See, they're, they're moving around. I mean, it's nice and warm. Maybe I should take a little bit of the heat off of them. I don't know. Um, I'll put this in there. It was about 90 last time, but... Uh, just really, really boggles my mind. I don't know. So, like I said, if you have any information... Help me out. I don't know. I'm really worried about these. I hate to see any animals die, and hopefully I can get this figured out before I lose any more. Just to show you and prove for the record, they're all eating. They're all fine. This one's over here playing around in that bowl. They have water. The water's over there. It does get clogged up sometimes with wood chips, which I remove from there. But, I mean, look at them. This, this is my, my proof here that these, these chickens are fine. Like, they're all housing the food. They're loving it. I just have no idea what could possibly be going on here.